It's a thing of beauty, isn't it? it sure is. Sort of bring a tear to your eye. What are we gonna do with them? I thought they were going to be heavier. There's no dog shit on this boulevard, is there? <laughs> Hope not. <laughs> the great VHS Hall of 2022. <laughs> this is a little bit of a different episode for us. We usually, of course, do the reviews, but we could not pass up doing an episode on this massive VHS haul that Justin landed. Yeah, I couldn't pass it up, too. I saw on Facebook Marketplace somebody was selling their entire collection. Most of it's horror. Horror and, like, this all these crazy kind of action movies and stuff like that and thrillers and everything so how could you pass it up some of these tapes separate are going for you know a decent amount of money Why? i know one of them i saw at a flea market for like 40 bucks and this ended up working out to be what uh, it's 140 total so how much per tape oh uh, it's like two dollars or something a tape between a buck fifty and two bucks a tape for some gems that are in here. Some real good stuff. Uh, some of them are cut boxes, some of them are um, you know, original sleeves. Jaguar lives. <laughs> like what the hell is that? And then you got son-in-law. <laughs> <laughs> so it's quite the assortment of things in here. I didn't even know Don Johnson had a music VHS. I. He's all directing on the back too. I thought that this, <laughs> when you showed this to me, I thought this was like an action movie. Cinderella, the, <laughs> the person obviously loved their hair metal, right? Def Leppard? I don't know, Bon Jovi I think I'll donate. Son-in-law definitely shouldn't be in the action. <laughs> uh. But there's some cool ones like this, like Evils of the Night, Drive-In Massacre. Oh, this is uh, the horror pile? Yeah. Okay, so let me see here. It's Drive-In Massacre. See, I saw a different... I saw a different version of this uh, at a flea market for 40 bucks. <laughs> and uh, we got it for two. Yeah. Yeah, the cover was different though. This is cool. I want to definitely want to watch that. Demented. I definitely want to watch Beverly Hills Vamp. <laughs> <laughs> She's all smoking in the tub. Well, that's what you did in the 80s. <laughs> Night Creature. I had this and I lost it. Is that the one with Donald Pleasance? Yep. Oh, yeah. That's the one I used yeah. to have. Yeah. I see this VHS around more often than the first one. I wanted to get the first one on VHS. Where have you seen that? Just kind of around, not locally, but like for oh. sale online. Oh. But I never see the first one for sale. People yeah. hold on to the first one. Yeah, because the second one's probably all garbage. This one sounds cool. Man outside. Look at the cover. He's all strung up. <laughs> <laughs> you have to remove all these price tags and try not to fuck up the cover. Yeah. Terminal it's... entry. That sounds like some sort of porn. <laughs> yeah. American Ninja 5. Oh, yeah. yeah. This look... Like, I haven't even heard of a lot of these titles. There's another cool looking one. The there. Destructor is like, what the? That looks super cool. Where's that? Oh, there's, there's one in here that... It looks awesome. Blown away. There's another one that sounds like a porn. Time Guardian. This one looks... That's that awesome. That looks cool. We split the cost, which I still owe you money for. Yes, yes. I'll pay you before you leave. <laughs> and to make it fair, what we're going to do is we're going to actually uh, have a draw. Film a VHS horror draw where it's a random draw as to who gets what tape to make it even. <laughs> yes. There's a chance that one guy might get a bunch of shit. And <laughs> so, then it'll be all pissed off. Yeah. I don't think there's many tapes in this haul that I actually own. Like if someone wants to sell a lot and you look at the listing, it's like, oh man, like I have yeah. most of those. So why buy the whole lot, right? Yeah, yeah. And then you have to super undercut them because you own half of yeah. them. You're just going to get rid of most of it. So usually like on a Sunday or something, we'll hop on our bikes old school and, and hit the thrift shops yep. looking for a VHS. Instead, this Sunday, we just had one big fucking massive haul. No bike riding <laughs> required. 
no getting down on the dirty floors and getting your pants all dusty at the flea market. I kind of like doing that every yeah, so Yeah, 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 me too. But uh, <laughs> it's it's nice to find uh, a big haul, you know. Yeah. We're gonna line up all the movies, and it's gonna be a random raffle. We're gonna draw all the names out of a hat. This Edge of Sanity movie, remember when oh, we yeah, watched we that? We tried watching that. It's yeah. all garbage. Oh, Dead Time Stories. Satan's Blade. That looks cool. This is cool. Haunts. Whoever had this was really into some obscure shit. Yeah, graduation day, man. Whoever gets this is that, a lucky man. That's that's like almost pristine too. I don't think it's ever been opened. Murder in New Hampshire with Helen <laughs> Hunt? Is this even horror? Oh, Scalpel. Ah, oh, Scalpel's so fucking good. I can't wait to review Scalpel. Then Madhouse too? It's a madhouse! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Scalpel is super cool. The Ambulance <laughs> with Eric Roberts. This is suspense. Should we put it in the horror pile? Nah. Yeah. This, Larry Drake. This looks cool. Mad Jake with John Saxon. Gary Busey and Mimi Rogers and Hyder in the house. <laughs> that time Gary Busey showed up at the store I work at and tried stealing guitar picks. <laughs> the gimps. Oh yeah, I always remember that one. Blackout. I've always wanted Blackout. Unmasked part 25. <laughs> Uh, there she is. So we'll see you next week at the great horror VHS raffle. <laughs>